To say that the Atlas is highly anticipated is an understatement, previewed as it first was way back in January 2013 by the Cross Blue concept and subsequently as the Cross Blue Coupe concept and the Cross Coupe GTE concept. It rides on VW's prolific MQB bones, which have been stretched to the max. Overall length is 198.3 inches, width is 77.9 inches, and height is 69.6 inches. The first two numbers make the Atlas nearly 4 inches longer than the Honda Pilot but an inch narrower. Its height falls between the Pilot's two available heights, which depend on trim level. Like the Cross Blue slash Cross Coupe concepts, the Atlas is decidedly masculine, with a broad and flat nose, flat topped wheel openings, a sloping rear window, and generally geometric forms, it resembles a larger, snappier Jeep Grand Cherokee. Giving it some distinction among its established competitors are a body side crease that rises over the wheels and standard LED headlamps underscored by LED daytime running lights. LED tail lamps will be optional. The Atlas will be offered in five different trim levels, we understand that none of them will be badged sport, and priced for the heart of the competitive SUV market, VW says. The interior is essentially the Passat writ large, with the driver and front passenger placed before a broad, flat, rather uninteresting dashboard. All Atlases will feature integration of Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and Mirror Link. VW's reconfigurable digital screen that replaces